the day you gave us, April 10th, 2020. Um, my big concern at the end of this day is just to be aware of the necessity, the urgency, the focus upon preaching our Lord Jesus Christ and making him known. Paul was in a situation, as recorded in Philippians chapter 1, uh, whereby he knew that certain people were seeking to preach Christ in order to uh, add to his uh, burden of being in prison. But these people were preaching the true Christ. Their motives may have been bad, but he would say this. He says, But what does it matter? The important thing is that in every way, whether from false motives or true, Christ is preached. And because of this, I rejoice. And my thought is along the lines of the importance of rejoicing in the preaching of Christ. Delighting in the fact that the Lord Jesus is being made known. Focusing on him being proclaimed. This time of uh, the corona virus outbreak we need to be aware of the opportunities that are being given through people having more time on their hands through the internet being available at the present time and i just really think that we should be sold out for making known the lord jesus christ one of the ways that we can be thoughtful about this is through our prayers uh, urgently praying for people but also thinking about how we can contact people through the means that we have of social media and also through all the other ways that we can get in touch with people and seek to make known the gospel of Christ. Various things may have happened to prevent us meeting or contacting people one to one, but let us seize the opportunity, seize the opportunity to make known our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. Get videos out. Get whatever out to people. Get articles out. Get the books out. The recent books that have come out by John Lennox and John Piper and Roger Carswell. Get hold of them. Get distributing them. <coughs> We've appointed for such a time as this a time to make known Christ. The most important thing is that people are made aware of the saving merits and the necessity of knowing Jesus Christ as their Lord and Saviour. So that's just on my heart at the end of this day, that we would be wanting Jesus Christ to be known, be praying for those who are at the forefront, praying for, for those who are, are getting these things out, for their effectiveness and what we can be doing. This is a time of opportunity. Let us seize it and let us seize it for the glory of our God, the spiritual benefit of those we would seek to help. So, this is the day you gave us, April 10th, 2020.